Oh. Okay. 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 That's a five medium kudu. And I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're back out in Verhonga Savannah for the second video in a row. We're looking for some new additions to the Trophy Lodge. We're not grinding anything in particular. Just kind of looking for any species. We got some... Look at this. We got some sides... Ooh, a big, big old herd of side-striped jackal out here. But anyways, we are back out here in Africa. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you enjoy this video, be sure to click that like button. It helps the channel. It helps the video so, 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 so much. Also, comment if there's anything you would like to see in a future video or just to say hello or pretty much anything you want to say. I want to hear it. I love the comments. I try to reply to all of them. I definitely read them all. I would love it if you would join the Discord. I'm going to leave the link in the description for that. You are more than welcome to join. Of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I would love to have you in the family. And without further ado, I think that's pretty much it. Let's get into the video. We've got a very nice four easy female Gemsbok out there. That's a dark as well. Let's see if we can take a long distance shot here. They're leaving. Drink time just ended for them. Straight down. Wow. I don't know if we got spine there. I hope not. Got Cape Buffalo coming in to drink. A couple two miners there. Three very easy off in the distance. There's some very hard coming in. You have to stop. Definitely not a diamond Gemsbach. But I'm curious where that shot landed. So we did get the spine, but we also got both lungs. So we're good. 320.8. That's a huge female Gemsbach there. Four easy dark. Very nice. So we got this herd of Springbok out here drinking. I'm really close. Oh, and they're alert. But there is an, an uncommon in there. The dark brown, I believe they're called. It's attentive. I'm going to do this real quick because I got a bad wind too. He's down. That should have been two down. Cool. I haven't seen one of those in a little while, actually. And here's this guy. Some extra cash there. 68.6 score. Bronze. Double long on that shot. 135.06 yards out with 243. And we'll take it. And this guy. I believe this was a two minor female. And that is the black brown fur type. Not a bad looking two minor. 74.3 score. She's a silver. And we got stomach left long on that shot from 139.65 yards with the 243. Very cool, very, very cool. I haven't seen one of those in quite some time. So way, way out there past that Cape Buffalo, we've got a big herd of Springbok resting. And right there, unless that's the shadow, what's that? Two minor. Unless that's just a shadow or something, I think that's another black brown way out there. 360. We try to go for that shot might be kind of fun actually maybe we'll just do that and we hit him but not very good oh what's that that's a, oh my gosh okay there's a nine legendary cape buffalo right there that i didn't see and that looks like that's definitely a diamond that might even be a big big rack Oh my gosh, okay. He needs to come back. I hope he turns around and comes back. But we've got a nine legendary cape off flow out there. That is just crazy. I didn't even see him. And if we hadn't taken that shot and spooked him, I probably wouldn't have. He was probably down in these trees. That is so, so crazy. So it doesn't look like that cape off flow is actually coming back. It looks like they are gone for good. Um, so we'll reset the time and hope that they come back to that drink zone in the morning. There he is. Okay, there he is. He is coming in. Now, I don't know where he's going to drink from. I'm thinking 
Somewhere in these trees he must have been, because I, I didn't see him. He must have been tucked away in these trees. So I'm going to slowly make my way down. They're all coming in. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to want to go down. Just down here. I'm just going to go all the way around to the left side here. And see if we can get a spot on these guys. I have no idea where they're drinking. They must be right in those trees. Because I could not see any of them. I honestly have absolutely no idea where these Cape Buffalo are drinking from. There was a f at least a few of them that, that went to this drink zone. And I don't see anything. Well, there's our dead Springbok. The black brown, we can see that. So I've come all the way around the right side of the lake. I'm now at the south side. This is where our tent is. This is where we swung around before. Couldn't see anything. This is where I am certain they are because they walked into these trees and have not come out and I still cannot get a spot on a single one of them. I'm hoping that by the time I get over here, over to this far side of the lake from our tent, that we're going to be able to see them. Okay, there's a couple more over there. There's the brown one. There he is. Oh my gosh. So he's right in that bush. And he's still behind bushes. He's literally inside that bush. Oh my gosh. Okay, but we got a spot on him. We know where he is. So he's right behind this three very easy female. Don't know if we're going to be able to keep this spot as we get closer. I definitely don't want to take a shot from here. I've only got the 300 on me. I don't have the 338. Um, I should probably be switching over because the 300 seems to be... Seems to have been demoted to a pea shooter recently, somehow, for some reason. I'm not really sure what the deal with that is, but I would like to get within 200 of this guy for taking a shot, if possible. And it should be possible here. You know what? I think we're going to do this. 255, we should get penetration. He's perfectly broadside. I feel like we got to do this. Bit of a blind shot there, but we got him. Yeah, we got him. He's going down. Yes. So I don't recommend trying that at home, kids. That's a little bit risky doing that, especially taking it blindly like that. But I felt pretty confident. I felt confident that we would get the penetration from 250. I wouldn't have done that from 300, but I think 250 was safe enough. And it looks like that did the trick. And this should be a Diamond Cape Buffalo, which is awesome because we just got trolled in the last video by a nine legendary. We missed by one point. And this guy definitely looks bigger than that guy looked. This guy, I think, is going to make diamond. I do believe that is the diamond. Definitely a diamond rack. I think this is going to be a diamond. That's incredible. He is a diamond. 153.3 scoring diamond cape buffalo. Let's go. Yes. Right long on that shot. 254.57 yards up. 254.57 yards out with the 300 Magnum. And I mean, look at that even. Just barely got the lung. Just barely had the penetration to get that lung. So almost a repeat from last time. That would have been absolutely tragic. But we got the diamond. We got the penetration we needed. We're definitely going to switch over to 338. I don't know what's going on with the 300. Like it was only a 254 yard shot and no penetration there whatsoever. Scores a 153.3. He's going straight into the trophy lodge. And that is just awesome. What an awesome hunt, guys. Got a springbok out there. We got some kudu moving in. Oh. Okay. 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 That's a five medium kudu. And I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. Um. Oh, I would love a diamond kudu, guys. I really, really would. That is so awesome. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Five medium lesser kudu. Hmm. I think we just probably just go for that shot. It's not a terrible angle. He is bedded, but he's broadside. Yeah. I think we're just going to take that shot, guys. He's 200 yards out. 
200 yards. Oh, we have the M1. La, da, da, da. Let's give them something to talk about. Let's give them some... Da, 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 da. Okay, I'm ready. I am ready. And he's down. And he's down. Oh my gosh, I am nervous. My heart is thudding. My palms are sweaty. Knees weak, arms heavy. His palms spaghetti. Knees weak, arms spaghetti. His vomit on his sweat of spaghetti. Oh, I hope he's a diamond. Oh, I hope he's a diamond. Come on, guys. Cross your fingers. Cross your toes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What is that? No. Oh, what are you? Can we get a rip in the chat for that, please? Okay, let's try this again. Round two, fight. Here we go, here we go. I can't pick him up. What's going on? Oh my God. Oh my God. You're jo you're- no. Don't- you can't do this. I will not let you do this. That's awesome. Yes! That's awesome! <gasps> oh my god. Oh my- oh my god. Oh, it's a good thing- it's a good thing I didn't give up on it. I was about to just take off. Oh my god, that's a diamond kudu. Double long on the shot. 197 yards out with the M1. I don't know what happened there. I was so- I was like so choked there. I st I must have stood there for 15-20 minutes trying to pick this thing up. I don't know if that's, I don't think that's max weight. Um, but it might be. 231.49 pounds. Amazing. Let's go. Oh, let's freaking go. And that's gonna wrap this one up, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to click that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We got a lot of awesome Call of the Wild content on the way. Feel free to join my Discord channel. The link is down below in the description. Leave me a comment down below if there's anything you'd like to see in a future video. And I will see you guys in the next one.